Willowbrook, I hope you've been following along in our New Testament 2020 challenge. We have been reading 1 Thessalonians, and today we close out that book with 1 Thessalonians chapter 5. A lot of 1 Thessalonians deals with the second coming of Jesus. In fact, your Bible may have a subtitle above chapter 5 that says the day of the Lord. Paul talks about what that day is going to be like, uh, coming like a, a thief in the night. In other words, creeping up on us, man, so fast, so unexpectedly, without a big fanfare or announcement. And the scripture says we've got to be ready. And then Paul says in more of a transition verse, in verse 11, he says, Therefore, remember, therefore, anytime we read that in the Bible, we look to, for, for the reason it is there for it's usually connecting a prior thought with a future thought. And so Paul says, because of the second coming of Christ, in other words, because we have limited time, because of the urgency, we should be feeling, therefore, encourage one another daily and build one another up as you see that day uh, approaching. How are you with encouragement? You know, are you somebody that when people are around you, they feel built up. One person has said it this way, that much like our bank accounts, people are either a credit or a debit to how we feel about ourselves. What, what are you? Uh, encouragement means so much. Encouragement makes us go further, faster. And encouragement also breeds inside of us a confidence many times to follow the Lord in the way that he's commanded us to. Let me challenge you with a simple thing you can do today, an immediate application. As soon as you're done watching this video, put down your phone if you're watching on your phone or put down your computer if you're using your computer. Open up a different app. Open up your texting app or your Facebook Messenger and send an encouraging message to someone you love. Send an encouraging message about an interaction you had with someone this last week. Send an encouraging message about someone's talents or abilities that you have appreciation for. Maybe, maybe go just a step deeper, send an encouraging message to somebody about what really matters most about their walk with the Lord and their time alone with Him. Hope you have a great day.